Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, it's nice to meet you. My name is Sandy. I'm the creative behind Sandy Solutions and I'm here to help you create digital content for your online business or brand. And for today's tutorial, I'll be teaching you where you can find fonts and how you can upload it to Canva so you can use it for your future graphics. All right, so let's get this started. So last week, I received a comment on one of my YouTube um, video from Ashley asking me, how do you upload your own fonts and where are you getting them from? So today, I'm going to walk you through the exact process that I do and where I find them and how, I, and how do I bring them to Canva so I can use them for future use. So the first thing that you wanted to do is to actually go to creativemarket.com. This is where you can buy fonts, um, graphics, icons, um, also templates. So this is like a huge market for creatives and for branding um, experts. So once you're in there, you can see here like d different um, categories of what you can purchase from creative markets. So they have graphics, they have fonts. So what you would like to do is go to fonts and then you can see there's like a category for different styles so you can just actually click on fonts and it will give you all of the available fonts for purchase so here are here they are so you can see how they will look like and also you can type something here so the font will appear in in such a certain word that you'd like to so you can you know view them better so let's just say for example let's say so that's how the font will look like okay so let me just change it back to my name okay so let's just say you've decided to purchase a font let's just say you wanted to purchase this font um, that's called Quincy so you just click on that it's for a hundred dollar but creative market has like fonts that's for only twelve dollars five dollars so you just scroll through the other options okay so once you're here you can just add to cart and then purchase it as how you do purchase online but for this tutorial I'm gonna walk you through and how you can download free fonts from creative market so all you have to do now is just go to get inspired and click um, free goods so creative market give out free goods like six free goods every week so that's they release that every Monday and then they give you out like free poster free um, mock-ups free stock photos and let's go find a font that's for free okay so here this is the only free fonts that they have this week, so I'm going to download this just so you guys can follow how the process is going to be. And then I'm just going to put it to my um, Dropbox. And then here's the zip file, so what you would like to do is to actually unzip that one first. And then go to the one that says OTF so just remember that file name and then now go to your Canva and then go to brand kit so just stay on Canva's homepage and click on brand kit so this one will only work if you have Canva Pro because if you have Canva Pro you can upload up to 100 fonts per brand kit so I'll just go right here and then this is where you can upload your font. So you have here your brand logos and your colors and on the right side is your brand font. So just click upload font and then find that file that you just downloaded and then choose the one that says .otf. So just click on that and then yes, upload away and just wait for it and there you go it's successfully uploaded I'm sorry I have a bunch of fonts so I'm gonna show you how you can use it on a design so I'm gonna go back to canvas homepage and pull up an Instagram post and then press T to pull up a text box 
and I'll just make it bigger so you guys can see okay now click on this and then find that font that we just uploaded so it was called something like this one here we go there you have it so let me just change it okay so this is not the ideal font for me but you know I just wanted to show you something that you can get for free as of the moment and there you go and then you can change the colors the size and then you can also add effects all right so um i hope you find this helpful uh video helpful if you like this video please don't forget to click like and subscribe bye for now see you in the next one